my friend and colleague from the state of Washington in objecting to this measure, a measure that would have allowed all members adequate time to review the bill and to vet it with constituents and debate it, discuss it, and amend it on the floor. She said that we have to get a move on. The government's been on autopilot, meaning under a continuing resolution for too long. But true, absolutely true. But I find it stunning, the suggestion that she's saying it, it, it's now that time is of the essence. Now, we didn't have the bill yesterday or the day before or the day before or the day before that when we were promised the bill. Uh, we didn't have it. We have it now. So she's identified the precise moment in history, the precise moment in 2024 when we can no longer move forward for another day. We've got to get a move on right, right now. They're the only ones who know this. She also says that it's bipartisan, that it's bicameral, that it is a carefully negotiated agreement. Well, that's great. The small handful of people who actually saw this bill and were involved in its uh, final formulation, I'm sure we'll find that very comforting. But for the rest of us who didn't see it until 2.30 a.m. this morning, and for the 330 million Americans out there who will have to pay for this stuff, that's not adequate notice. That's not a carefully negotiated agreement. That is collusion among the few, affecting the many adversely. And I find this uh, very, very disturbing that we couldn't give the American people and their elected representatives a few more days so that they can understand what's in there. Begs the question, what are they hiding? Senator Mike Lee's critique of the rushed and opaque process enveloping the $1.2 trillion spending package raises pertinent concerns. His address echoes widespread apprehensions regarding transparency, authenticity, and the intricate relationship between citizens and governing bodies. Senator Mike Lee's discourse appears to embody democratic values such as transparency, accountability, and fiscal prudence. His critique of the hurried and obscure legislative process may signify feelings of alienation, helplessness, and a gradual erosion of trust in the democratic apparatus. By questioning the sudden unveiling of the bill and the inadequate time for thorough review, Senator Lee seems to highlight the government's excessive exercise of authority and the neglect of proper legislative protocols. His inquiries into the hidden facets of the bill can be construed as probing the nature of political power and its implications on individual lives. Senator Mike Lee underscores the significance of allowing ample time for all members to scrutinize and deliberate on the bill aligning with the tenets of conservative governance constraints and reverence for democratic norms. His speech serves as a testament to conservative opposition towards precipitous and clandestine governmental actions impacting taxpayer finances.